Okay, we're, we're just going to uh, talk about, uh, you have a title. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, it was called, well, I have, all of these are excerpts that, again, that I put together. They're called One of Life Moments. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And it was something that I was sharing on my website. It was almost like a monthly inspirational for visitors to my website. Mm -hmm. And I was sharing um, them at different events. And, and a, a woman actually came up to me and she said, this reminds me so much of the books that I own called Soup for the Soul. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I said, really? She said, yes. Yeah. Said, um, she said, what are you planning on doing with these? I said, I don't know. Um, I said, actually, about 10 of them I've actually recorded myself where I read the quote, the story, and then I elaborated about what it all meant to me. Mm -hmm. She asked me why I was doing that. And I said, you know, for my company, I want to have a members only section to my website where if you are a member, that you're able to listen to those recordings. Just kind of... Let me, let me interject right mm -hmm. there. Now, because before when we were on talking on your one-on-one, -on -one, you said that you wanted to know if this is taking the readers too far. Now that you see what you just said should be the beginning of your mm -hmm. book, what mm -hmm. you just said to me. I, I uh, decided that I wanted to... I have to see it so I can help you reword it. Mm -hmm. But the way you just said that, that is leading me into wanting to see all these. Okay. See what I'm saying? So you mm -hmm. can't just start with the quotes. Right. I have to give you have, the story you got first. You to give the story of first. Why of doing why this, you're why doing I'm this. sharing it. Okay. Mm -hmm. That well, was perfect. Yeah. And, and if you need to uh, look at that video, or you, I hope you can remember what <laughs> yeah, you just Oh, yeah, said. I can remember because that's exactly what it is. Well, you drew me in. Mm -hmm. So now I want to see those morning uh, quotes that you did, and I want to see what those quotes meant to you. Mm -hmm. So each, th that that's, yes, it's a book. It ties into everything. Okay. And uh, what I would, would say is looking at this right here, this is your quote, and looking at this right here. I would like to see you expound a little bit more. Okay. I would like to see each quote be almost a half a page. Okay. And that's what I did in my audios. Mm -hmm. When I did my audios, I did this and I read that and uh -huh. then I elaborated on it. Yes, because that so. because this this is not going to be enough for me. I mm -hmm. can tell that. And your, your reader is going <laughs> to yeah. want to get more from that quote. It's almost like you. when you watch a movie and then they get to the end and you go, well, why didn't they show them get married? Exactly. <laughs> why exactly. Yeah, okay, exactly. I'll leave people so, hanging. So with that, me. this is awesome. And so your title is going to be? Moments and then Life Lessons Learned and kind of like that. Um, before I had it as one of life moments, mm -hmm. I didn't know if that was, I thought moments, not one of life moments, because these are more than one. Mm -hmm. So moments, uh, life moments, mm -hmm. life moments, yeah, life moments, mm -hmm. life moments. Mm -hmm. okay. And then, uh, subtitle lessons learned. Okay. Cause like mine is drifted back in time and then quote, deep secrets revealed. Mm -hmm. See what I'm saying? Right. So I think life's moments. And then lessons learned. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Beautiful. Yeah. Uh -huh. I've also, um, a few of them have um, gone to the Bible to find Bible verses that were, because some of them are stories of helping people get through stuff. Mm -hmm. um, let me see if I can find. Oh. Oh, I'm excited. <laughs> uh, let's see. When's hindsight? That's the one I'm looking And over a period, how many years you've been doing this? Since 2006. Oh, you got a book. You should have a big book. I just grave say this. This is actually all of them from 2006. Well, see, that's why I'm telling mm -hmm. you that's not enough. Right. I was just grave say. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got to really get into it. And let me tell you something else, this too. This is what I was talking about. Okay. Read this one to me. Okay. Again. Um, don't let hindsight convince you that you are a failure. I sit and listen to her describe all the warning signs that were there from the beginning of their relationship. It is now years later, and those warning signs have proved to be accurate. Their relationship has now reached the end of its journey. I hear her say, what if, multiple times during our conversation. I begin to ask her a few what if questions. The difference between mine and hers is the answers to my questions promote forward thinking. I try feverishly to reach and pull her out of the past. Her focus needs to be on now, soon, and forever. I do believe we learn from the past. However, we shouldn't spend time trying to solve a past that cannot be altered. I tell her to pay close attention to where she is and the direction she is going toward. If she would focus on this, she will automatically pull what is beneficial from the past to push herself forward. I held her hand 
and told her to don't let hindsight convince her that she is a failure. Hindsight is supposed to be a motivator, not a negator. Awesome. Now let me tell you what I got. Mm -hmm. it, it's awesome. I would love to see you tell me who she is. Mm -hmm. I know who you are. You said right. I. Make a story. Mm -hmm. Tell me who she is. Tell me a little bit about her. Why are you saying this to her? Okay. See, each yeah. one of these are life moments, and they're for you. And I, I like for you to keep yourself in each one of them, though. Okay. That's the only way you can tie them all in to like your life moments. Okay. And you might want to make it my life moments. Mm. Okay. And then this this is perfect because all through it, I'll be waiting to hear another moment in your life. Mm -hmm. With who? Mm -hmm. Okay. All you got right. an awesome book there. Okay. You got an awesome book there. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, that's what they pretty much. This was a friend again that was having problems in her marriage, mm -hmm. and I knew them very well. Mm -hmm. And then it was an event where I actually was traveling um, and met three individuals right after 9/11. Mm -hmm. And um, oh, you got a big book there. Don't this, don't yeah, stop. just oh great. Say this one here is just is just an awesome story about mm -hmm. the three people I met on that trip and how they changed, how just the interaction changed my life, and they would never know. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. we were just, we met on a plane. Oh, that's wonderful. You know, doing a trip. That's so wonderful. that's kind of how, you know, mm -hmm. this. And then I have stories in here after I lost my grandmother. Mm -hmm. um, and if it's somebody like that, you, you say that. Let, mm -hmm. let, let people know where this moment in your life came from. Right. This is awesome. I think I would put my life moments. Okay. So that we will be following you. Mm -hmm. Let's take going through the journey going with the me. the journey with you. Okay. This is awesome. It, it's so yeah. awesome because um, Patrice is Shake the Box. That's her title. Mm, I like that I title. Like that I title. like that title. So she's, uh, we, we were able to really get her started like this. Her, hers is, 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 you guys are different, mm -hmm. but, but the same. Because she's, she's shaking the box through her journey of life. And you are shaking the box through moments with people, mm -hmm. with different aspects of your life. Mm -hmm. It's not hers is from growth, I believe, what with okay. her grandmother, her growth. Right. Yours is life moments with individuals throughout your life, right. which is awesome. Yeah. That's, that's okay, awesome. so what it, what, it, what it derives right. from is the fact that I think individuals should never ever minimize minimize the moments that they oh share with Oh my goodness, I, I could sit here, this this is awesome because this is going to make people start thinking, because I was sitting here thinking about a time that I got on an elevator, and uh, I can show you in my film, you might have seen it in my film when I was talking, I had this butterfly in my hair, mm -hmm. and this butterfly was just shimmering. Well, I used to buy those butterflies, because I love butterflies, mm -hmm. I used to buy them that shimmer in my hair, and I got on the elevator, and this couple, white couple, with a cute little child, and that child said, oh, mommy, look, oh, she, that's so pretty. I said, you like it? She says, yes, and I took it out and put it in her hair. I'm like, oh, no, don't do it. I said, she can have it. She said, yeah. oh. the child was so excited. Oh, it was such a... And that brought so much joy to It you. brought so much joy to me, but the joy to that child's face was just awesome. Yeah. You know? Yes. Yeah. yeah. So I'm, I'm going to catch this call and okay. stop the tape. Okay.